my baby. Oh, a perfect family? Is this a joke? Hmm. <sighs> huh, wait till you see my daughter. <laughs> Why does it take so long to give birth? <sighs> oh! My daughter should be prettier than their daughters. Huh. They're gonna feel jealous of me because my daughter's gonna be perfect. Yes! Oh. oh. Finally, I can't wait to see her. <laughs> Mom! How's Michelle? <laughs> Mom, the baby's here. I can't wait to see her. I'll be there in a bit. Okay, we'll wait for you. I can't wait to hold the grandest party for my granddaughter. There's no need to rush, Mom. Michelle still needs to recover. <sighs> for this party. I'll take care of everything. <clears throat> Mom, gotta go. The baby's here. All right, all right. I'll be there. I'm so excited. All right, Mom. Bye. How's my daughter? Hmm. Huh? Ah! <sighs> Doctor, what's wrong with this baby? There's nothing wrong with your baby. She's healthy and fine. No, she's not fine. What is this? This dirty mark on her face. Ah, <sighs> that's not dirt. It's a birthmark. She's born with this. No, no, no. You need to find a way to remove this right away. She's still a baby. We can't do anything about it. Don't worry, it'll fade soon. Soon? <sighs> How soon is that? I can't wait any longer. I have plans. I'm sorry, but I cannot do anything about this. This baby is your daughter, Mr. Austin. No, she is not. Mr. Austin. Hmm. Don't you dare talk back to me. Find a way to remove this huge mark on her face. If you have to switch the baby to another baby, then go ahead. Do what you need to do. Just get rid of her. I, I'm sorry, but I, I can't do that. Do you still want to see your family alive? Do I need to scare you so that you'll be able to follow what I say? I, uh, oh, okay, I'll, I'll do it. to do anymore. I'm really sorry. I hope you can still forgive me. I can't do this. Let's stay away from here. I'm really sorry. I don't have a choice. 
I also have a family to protect. I'm... I'm really sorry. you here. Hmm. Honey, look who's here to visit you. She fell asleep while I was carrying her. Oh, she's so beautiful, just like her mom. Thank you, babe. <laughs> babe? Hmm. Is there something wrong? I don't know if I remember it right, but I think I saw a brown mark on her forehead before I lost consciousness from giving birth. Hmm. No, oh, uh, yeah, m maybe you're remembering it wrong, huh? <laughs> Our baby's just as perfect as you. Maybe you were just hallucinating because of the medication. Yeah, you're right. She is perfect. <laughs> Michelle, honey, how are you? Hi, Mom. I thought you were busy with work. Yes, I am, but I will always make time for my granddaughter. You're so sweet. Oh, my! Perry, she is so beautiful. <laughs> of course, Mom. <laughs> What's her name? Maeve. <laughs> Give up! Never. <laughs> this time, I'll win. <laughs> That's what you thought. <laughs> oh, I hate this! Just accept the fact, Iris. You are weak. Uh, I'm just tired, Nathan. And I don't want to waste my energy on you, duh. Iris! Ouch! <laughs> Both of you, stop it. Mom, Nathan is so annoying. All right, all right. Cut it out, you two. I have something for both of you. What is it? What is it? Hmm. Since you've been taking care of other kids here in the adoption center, I want to give you this. <laughs> Soda! Can you open this for me, Nathan? Of course. Our weak Iris. <laughs> Iris! <laughs> you deserve it! Ugh, this place is starting to suffocate me. <sighs> Ah. Don't stop me or else you'll be fired. Sir, yes, sir. <laughs> Better. <laughs> Did you just mess with the fire alarm? Sorry, Dad. I don't want to shop with other people. It's so disgusting. Maeve, you're gonna get me in trouble again. Dad, I know you love me. <laughs> All right. Do you need... Did he just hang up on me? <laughs> Leave it there. That's dirty. Sir, yes, sir. Where 
are you going? Hmm. Maeve messed with the fire alarm again. Oh my gosh, Maeve. Our daughter's always going to get us into trouble. Just let her be. She's just having fun. Honey, just because this is our mall doesn't mean that Maeve can push the fire alarm anytime she wants. I know, but let's just understand her. We're too busy because of our business, and maybe she's doing it to get our attention. I don't know, Michelle. I'll pick her up and have a talk with her. Don't be too hard on your daughter, all right? <laughs> be sure to be home for dinner. I'll prepare your favorite food. Thanks, honey. I gotta go now. Goodbye! Maeve, I've told you so many times, don't push the alarm. It's not a toy. I was just having fun. Maeve. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, Dad. Are you ready for the charity ball? Hmm. Not yet. I am so stressed about it because I want to stand out from the crowd. Nah, you don't gotta think about it. Your mom's gonna prepare everything for you. Of course. What is wrong with you? Are you trying to kill us? Hmm. What's wrong? Hmm. Are you okay, Iris? Oh. What are you doing there? Mm. Are you mad? Huh? Yes, I'm mad because you're wasting my time. This is unbelievable. Are you still asleep? You're the one who is not looking. Dad, what's wrong? Hmm? These two people are trying to scam me. Hmm. What? Nathan. Oh. Iris, do you need anything? Hmm. Let's just go. Maeve called the police and our lawyer. Yes, Dad, I will. Okay. Hey, scammers, show your faces. You, lift your head up. Mom. Let's just go. No, Iris. He deserves to be in jail for this. Nathan, if this news gets to the adoption center, they will no longer allow us to go outside. <sighs> Iris. It's all right, Nathan. Let's go. Dad, look! <sighs> Hey, where are you going? What are you doing? Hey! You! Ow! Ouch! That man is the worst. If I see him again, I'll make sure I'll crush him. <laughs> How will you crush him? Your body is too small and weak. Hey, I have muscles. <laughs> what I did to him was enough. I pushed him hard enough to make him fall to the ground. Are you proud of that? Hmm? Of course. <laughs> well, I'm proud of my muscles. <laughs> ew, Nathan, ew. I'll make sure he will regret what he did. Just ignore him. Rich people tend to overreact even though they're the ones at fault. Nathan? Uh, he has the nerve to get mad at us even though his car clearly hit you. <gasps> you got hit by a car. Uh-oh. Nathan? I am, Marley. <laughs> Mom, it's not that serious. What happened? Hmm. Let's just say a car slightly hits her. Slightly? Yep. <laughs> Iris, explain. Uh. Oops. Oh, oh, ouch, ouch. Uh, uh, um, be right back. I have to go to the comfort room. Bye. Iris. <sighs> All right. Here's what happened. <sighs> What happened? Hmm. 
Some strange kid pretended to be hit by our car. They don't know that we are smart enough to know that they are scamming us. They really have a weird way to get money from people like us. Maeve, we are just like everyone else. <sighs> we are rich and they are not. There is a difference. We may have more money than them, but it doesn't mean we are way above them. <sighs> Whatever, Mom. You know what's the most disappointing part? Dad just let the girl push him. He froze there while looking at the scammers. Ugh. Really? Yes, Mom, and please let's stop talking about this. I'm going to my bedroom now. Good night. Hmm. Honey? Are you okay? I, I'm, I'm fine. I shouldn't think about it. The charity ball is coming and I don't want to look too stressed out. Hey! Hello. Tonight, we'll pick you up at the park. Uh, I thought this plan was canceled. Well, a road trip won't kill us, so we decided to continue the plan. My god, you should have told me earlier. My parents won't allow me to go out tonight. We know you can find a way. Wait for us there, alright? We will pick you up at the park. Okay. What should I do? Hmm. <laughs> I am so beautiful. <laughs> Hey, walk a little slowly. I'm still in pain. Give me a little consideration. Come on, Iris. I told you not to come with me. I can sell this on my own. Hmm. We're in this together. We have to raise money to get out of the adoption center and start a new life. I know, Iris, but I can do this alone. No, you can't. <laughs> Faster! You go first. Uh, all right, chill. Get these. I got it. <laughs> uh, shut up, Iris. Success. Many people have donated this time. Yeah, and I hope we will sell all of these before sunrise so that we can get back on time. <sighs> I feel guilty for selling all this donated stuff, but we can't use all of this inside the adoption center. This will just go to waste if we do not sell these things. Faster! Virus, ah! <clears throat> run! Oh my gosh! Ah! Get away from me! Who are you? Shh, be quiet. Iris, come on! Hey! Iris, I know you're in pain, but this is not the right time to act like a girl. Come on! Who? Hey! Come on! <sighs> Thank you. Um, why did you help me? 
Are you a stalker? Hey! Am I talking to a wall? When I'm talking to you, you should answer me! What if I don't want to answer? Huh? You've got an attitude! Look, who's about to throw tantrums now? What's your name? Hmm? <laughs> it's for you to find out. Howie. Whew, that was close. Are you okay, Iris? I told you I am not Iris. Uh, who, who are you? I am not Iris. I know you're not Iris, so chill. Hmm. How can I chill if some random kid dragged me here? I am not just a random kid. I am the future successful businessman in the world. Hmm. What? Are you hallucinating? Mm -hmm. No, I'm not. They're here! <laughs> Finally! Hmm. Dad? Hmm. Where do you think you're going, Maeve? Dad, I'm sorry! <sighs> Get inside. Hmm. Iris, oh, I'm glad you're fine. Where have you been? You left me. No, I didn't. I grabbed the wrong person. I thought it was you. Nathan, really? Hmm. Yes, if you don't believe me, then we can go back to the park. No way, my foot is already hurting. I want to rest now. All right, I'll go in first. Iris. What? You, you can get inside now. Next time, we'll make this hole bigger so that it will no longer be hard for us to go outside. <laughs> Why are you there? Let's go! <sighs> hey! Get inside! <laughs> We are in trouble. Big, big trouble. <sighs> Hello? Did you find her? Give that to me. Okay. Oh. Who is she with? Mm -hmm. Great job. <laughs> I'll get you back, my daughter. I've been looking for you. Oh, she looks just like her mother. Whoa. <laughs> I hope they will love me. Iris! Do you want to break the door? Get inside! <sighs> oh, wow! The dress is pretty. <laughs> yeah, she is. <laughs> what? Huh? Um, yeah, it is. Hmm? What are you hiding? Hmm? Oh, yep. <laughs> this is for you. If you'll get adopted this time, uh, please, don't forget about me. <laughs> I still don't have money yet, but when I become successful, I will buy you anything you want. Th thanks Nathan. <laughs> Iris, they are here. Hello, I am sorry for the wait. Oh, it's all right. <laughs> I would like you to meet Iris. Hello, I'm Iris. Ew. Uh, oh, no! <laughs> no! Babe, calm down. 
I thought we made ourselves clear that we will adopt your prettiest girl here. <sighs> Iris is pretty. No, she is not. Look at that mark on her face. Is that a skin disease? You should not let other people see her. <laughs> Ma'am, you are now being too much. Ugh, let's go, babe. I don't want to continue adopting her. Well, I'm really sorry. I'm sorry, Mom. Iris, don't listen to that woman. You're pretty, all right? Am I hideous? Why would she tell you to hide me? No, you're not. <sighs> I will never let them adopt Iris. It will just hurt her feelings. <laughs> Who's this? <clears throat> Good morning, sir. <laughs> Where's the person in charge here? Um, she's cleaning inside while the kids are playing. Call her. <laughs> mm -hmm. By the way, tell her that I'm also going to adopt a girl named Iris. a big mark on my face. I'm still lovable, right? <laughs> I hate my life! Iris, honey. <gasps> Mom, I want to be alone! Iris, may I speak with you? Hmm? Honey, I need to talk with you. What is this about, Mom? Me not being adopted because I look like this? Iris, you're pretty all right. Don't make that woman affect you. You're the best person I've ever met. <sighs> Mom, I'm trying to forget everything she said to me, but it keeps on repeating inside my head. Iris, I'm going to tell you something. What is it, Mom? Hmm? <sighs> I would like you to meet my daughter. Daughter? You are the best thing that ever happened to me. <laughs> I was so sad and lonely because I always blamed myself for what had happened until one day you arrived into my life unexpectedly. Mom. You are the reason I don't feel alone. Iris, honey, I have good news for you. What is it, Mom? <laughs> you should pack your things. <laughs> Hi, you don't like me anymore? Of course I like you. <laughs> then what is it? You are going to have a complete family. You're getting adopted tomorrow. Woohoo! <laughs> Is there something wrong, Perry? Hmm? Michelle, tomorrow, we're gonna have a new member in the family. <laughs> Are we getting a dog? A cat? Hmm... No, Michelle. I adopted a girl named Iris from the adoption center. What? You adopted a kid without even asking us first about it? Hmm... Michelle, you'll love her, I promise. <sighs> Am I not enough? I think this means war. Iris, welcome to your new home. <laughs> you can go. Sir, yes, sir. Hello, my name is Iris. <laughs> well, new daughter, welcome home. 
I never experienced that type of hug from dad. I am his real daughter, but he always treats me like I'm not. No, you don't have to remind me. I I'm sorry. Oops. What's on your face? Is that a paw? Yes, I was born with this paw birthmark on my face. <sighs> um, okay. Hmm. By the way, don't even try to think that you can replace my daughter, Maeve. She will always be our daughter. You're just a stranger living in our house. What am I getting myself into? You? Are you the leader of Paw Patrol? Hmm. Paw Patrol? Huh? Oh, yeah, I forgot. You don't have a television. Well, we have one, but we don't really use it often. Hmm. What's your name? My name is Iris, and your name is Maeve, right? How'd you know? <laughs> Well, your mom came inside the room and told me that you're their daughter. <laughs> well, that's great that you already know. Don't you dare forget about that. I yes <sighs> Also, I've heard that we are going to the same school. You should be proud of yourself because finally you can experience the life of being rich. You can go to school, eat expensive food, and ask my dad for money. Um, I didn't ask dad for money. I have my own savings from selling stuff back when I was in the adoption center. <laughs> you call him dad now? Wow, unbelievable. <gasps> I'm warning you, you stay away from my dad. I wonder how Iris is doing. Oh, I miss her. Hey! Where's the person in charge here? Hey, what are you doing here? Huh? Oh my gosh, it's you! Why are you here? <sighs> we don't want Iris anymore. I want you to take her back. You know what? Iris is not a toy! Just because you don't like Iris does not mean you can return her or even abandon her anytime you want. She's not a toy. You don't have the right to play with her feelings. This is the worst day of my life! Why does everybody like her? Because she is Iris. We don't like her, okay? You! You don't like her! I hate this! Don't! I don't want to be seen with you. Next time, don't come with me to school. Huh? But... What's this? Hmm. Can't you read? That's a foundation. Use that to hide that dirt on your face. Uh, thank you, Maeve. I'll go inside now. Wait for 20 minutes before you get inside the school. Uh, all right. <laughs> Give me the phone. Hey! Oh, hello there, darling. Dad! Hi, it's Maeve! No, it's, it's you, Maeve. Where's your sister? Sister? I don't have a sister. Maeve. All right, I'll give the phone to Iris. <sighs> Dad! Please, don't look at me. <sighs> Who is she? She is so pretty. 
Whoa. <gasps> what is that? <laughs> uh, you. Hi, can we meet again? <laughs> You're here. Mm -hmm. Why are you taking my picture? Hmm. Welcome to our school, Polly. <laughs> Ugh, stop calling me Polly! I'm not a dog! They don't know that I have a paw birthmark on my face! Just call me Iris. <laughs> okay, Polly. Hey! <laughs> See you later, Polly. Not bad. Uh, this picture is good. <laughs> hmm. Maeve. Where are you? I'm in the photography room. Why? Do you need anything? Hmm. No, I thought you were at the mall skipping classes. Um, I've heard that you like me. Do you want to be my boyfriend, Theo? Hmm. What? No way. But why? Why should I? Huh? I am the prettiest girl in the school, and you decided to reject me? Why? I told you I don't like you. Isn't that enough reason not to date you? One day you'll regret your decision. Nope. I already like someone else, and I'm 100% sure that's not you. <sighs> wow. survive this day. Where's my notebook? It was here! <gasps> mm, where did I put it? <sighs> Why are they silent? Why is she here? Hello, Meeve! <laughs> I'm sorry, but I don't talk to strangers. Bye! <gasps> but I'm you. Stop talking, will you? It's annoying. <sighs> I'm sorry, Maeve. school. I hate this day, Mom. It's still the first day, but that girl gives me bad luck. Uh, oops. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll tell your father to transfer Iris to another school. <laughs> or we can just let her take the bus on her way to school. That's a great idea. Iris, bring me some soup. Okay. Here, Meeve. <sighs> Are you trying to hurt me because you're jealous of me? Are you okay, Maeve? <sighs> What's wrong with you? I'm really sorry. I didn't do it on purpose. Really? You didn't? <sighs> I, I promise, Mom. Don't call me Mom, because I am not your mother. Ugh. <sighs> <sighs> No, please! I am afraid of being alone! Please, I beg you! I don't care! Please! <laughs> Wait, walk sign is on. I should buy Iris her favorite chocolate cake! I'm so excited to see her. Hey! Hey! That's mine! <laughs> Come back! Hey! <sighs> uh, Iris. Nathan, I don't want to stay here anymore. I want to go back to the adoption center. Someone, please help me! 
Please, let me go! Please! All I want in life is a family. I want to be part of a family who treasures me and accepts me for who I am. Oh, I'm so hungry. This isn't enough. Please let me go! Please! <gasps> Iris? Iris, what are you doing here? Dad, please bring me back to the adoption center. Please, I'm begging you. What? Who did this to you? Dad, please, it doesn't matter anymore. Please let me go back to the adoption center. Okay, Iris, get your things. I'll call the driver to drop you off at the adoption center. Thanks, Dad. We have to talk. Oh, I thought you were going on a business trip. Is there something wrong, honey? Why is Iris inside the storage room? I, I don't know. Are you sure that you don't know? I yeah. All right, then I'll go talk to Maeve. Perry? I did it. But why, Michelle? Hmm. You don't care about your Maeve anymore because of Iris. Yes, because Iris is my daughter. Let me remind you that Iris is just your adopted daughter, while Maeve is your real daughter. No, Michelle. Why do you keep on protecting Iris? Hmm. Because she's our real daughter, Michelle. What do you mean by that? Remember what you said when you regained your consciousness after giving birth? You noticed a mark on your daughter's face? I, I was hallucinating because of the medicine! No, you didn't. What do you mean? You were the one who handed me our baby! Look, I made a mistake, alright? Cause my aim to be the number one at everything, I decided to abandon our daughter. I told the doctor to remove the birthmark on her face, or get me another baby. I tried to stop the doctor, but it was too late. When I checked the doctor's car outside, they weren't there. I contacted the doctor's number, but told me the doctor was nowhere to be found. No, this is not true. When I saw Iris on the street, I immediately hired someone to investigate her. No, you're just saying that because you want Iris to replace your daughter. All right, here's some more proof that you will believe. Hmm. What is that? Hmm. DNA test result of me and Iris. Whoa. Oh my god, no! What have I done? It's my fault. I'm sorry for keeping this from you. I was looking for the right time to tell this to you. This is all your fault! I know, and I'm sorry. I was just obsessed with being the best. I know that I've messed up. That's why I tried everything to get back all the time that I've lost. I... I don't know what to say. <sighs> Come here. <sighs> I am never going back to that place. It's all right, Iris. You know that we are always here for you, no matter what happens. Thanks, Mom. Mom? Where's Nathan? I should ask you that question. I haven't seen Nathan ever since I got adopted. What? He begged me to allow him to visit you. I'll try calling him. He has a phone? I let him borrow my phone in case something like this will happen. <sighs> He's not answering. Iris! Nathan! <laughs> Ouch! Oh my gosh, what happened? This is nothing. <gasps> Nathan, what happened? Well, I was on my way to buy a cake for Iris when 
Suddenly, a thief snatched my hard-earned money. Hmm. So you chased the thief? Yes, and I got hit by a car. Thankfully, the driver was able to stop the car. I got hit, but these are minor bruises. Why didn't you go to the hospital? I received your message that Iris is coming back, so I declined their offer to go to the hospital and walked as fast as I could to see Iris. Nathan, you should have got yourself checked at the hospital. No, nah, it's all right. <sighs> Come, let's get inside and clean your bruises. Why do you keep on protecting Iris? Because she's our real daughter, Michelle. That's why Dad is distant with me. I'm not their real daughter. <laughs> Make sure all the plants are watered. All right, boss. <sighs> hey, you! What is it, boss? Can you get me a glass of water, hmm? I need to drink water so that my bruises will heal immediately. Then go get it! You can still walk, right? Hmm... Ouch! Oh! Uh, look at my bruises! It is so painful! Uh... Okay, okay... Mm, very good. <laughs> <laughs> cold, cold. There's your water. I said a glass of water, not a splash of water. I see. I'm really sorry. I thought you said a splash of water. <laughs> Run for your life. <laughs> Iris. I'll get inside first, okay? Just shout if you need help. Thanks, Nathan. <sighs> hey, Iris. Oh, we missed you. Wow. Hmm. I missed you too, Dad. Iris, I'm so sorry for what happened. It's all right, Dad. Actually, we're here to tell you something important. Come, let's talk there. All right. Michelle? Iris, my daughter, I'm really sorry. If I knew earlier that you were my real daughter, I would have treated you better. Wait, what? You are our lost daughter, Iris. <laughs> Everything's my fault. And until now, I still feel guilty about what happened. That's the DNA test result that proves that you are our real daughter. <laughs> I have a mom and dad? Wow. Yes, Iris, and we are so sorry for what we've done. I am a bad mother to you. <sighs> it's all right, Mom. I mean, Michelle. I... I thought you were going to get mad at us. Why are you so calm about it? Huh? Every kid wants to have a family. I thought I was an orphan because I didn't know if my parents were still alive. I don't even know my birthday. I've been hoping and praying the state would come, and it finally did! I'm so happy to know I have a family. I don't want to waste another time hating or blaming someone because of what has happened. Don't cry, Michelle. I forgive both of you. You can call me mom. Wow! So does this mean you're gonna come home with us? Please give us a chance to enter your life again, Iris. Yes, Mom and Dad. <laughs> Mom, where are you? Do you want to go shopping with me? Hmm. I'm sorry, Maeve, but I can't. Um, all right. How about dinner? Hmm. I'll cook here at home. Wow, you're cooking for us? <laughs> of course. Today is a great day, so I have to prepare a special dinner for my family. You're so sweet, Mom. Mom, Todd wants cheese-flavored 
fries. Okay, Iris, I'm almost done here. Is Iris there? Yes, she is. She decided to stay with us again. But why? Why not? She is your sister. She should stay with us. Mom, I'll call you later. I'm on my way home. <laughs> so, what are we watching today? Horror movie? Hmm. Game! Mom, Dad, I'm home! Hmm. This is enough! Maeve, what are you doing? I am so sick of this, Dad! I know the truth, alright? I'm not your real daughter, but that doesn't mean that you'll forget about me! We didn't forget about you. You treated me differently! You always hug Iris, but you never did that to me! You keep on calling Iris to ask for an update, but when it comes to me, you will just wait for me to call you! Maeve? Maeve, I understand what you're feeling, and I know this is hard for all of us, but please give Dad a chance to explain. <sighs> Shut up! You stole them from me! No, I didn't, Maeve. Yes, you did! I haven't had parents for 18 years, Meeve. I also want to know what it feels like to have parents. You stole them from me! I didn't steal them from you! You borrowed them from me! I feel so jealous because you grew up with them, but for me? <gasps> I grew up alone! Now I'm here trying to spend time with them to make up for the time we've lost, and here you are! Trying to break us apart! Can't you just accept me in your life? I will not force myself in this family any longer! If there's someone who's forcing herself in the family, it's me! Sometimes, Maeve, you just need to understand things and be considerate. We gave you everything you wanted, gave you all the attention you want. Just because we spent some time with Iris does not mean that we forgot about you. Maeve? Honey, there's a letter from Maeve. Dear Mom and Dad, I'm really sorry for being ungrateful. I'm just used to receiving all of your attention ever since I was a kid. Dad, I'm sorry for what I said last night. You did your best to be a good father to me. Mom, please be a good mother to Iris and take care of her like how you took care of me. I will be forever grateful for your presence. Please. Just give me some time to think and don't, don't look, look for me anymore. I'll be back whenever I'm ready. I love you both. I hope she'll come back. <sighs> oh, me too. Oh. Hey, you're cool. Where'd you get those? Hmm. What do you mean? I love the mark on your face. <laughs> Oh no, I forgot to hide my birthmark! That is a birthmark? Wow, that is awesome! Um, thank you. <laughs> um, I thought they would hate my birthmark. Tali! <laughs> You're finally showing off your birthmark. I, I forgot to bring my makeup. That's great to know. Honestly, your birthmark makes you unique and beautiful. If you ever get lost, I can easily spot you in a crowd. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. By the way, I've noticed your eyes. Were you crying? Huh? Well, yeah, you know, sometimes you need to cry to clean your eyes. <laughs> okay then, I'll cry later so that you'll notice my pretty eyes. <laughs> I hope you're doing well. I'm still hoping that I will find you someday. Come in. Hi! How can I help you with today? Hmm. Hello, I'm Maeve. I've been here before and I want to know something. Okay, um... So what is this about? I saw a picture of a baby and a mother on that side. Do you still have it? 
Hmm. Wow. Ah. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Here it is. Who's in this picture? Well, that is me and my long-lost daughter. She got kidnapped inside her room when she was a month old. <gasps> hey, what's wrong? <gasps> oh my god! Maeve. Hey, did you miss me? Hmm? Yeah, of course. Where should we eat our lunch? My girlfriend should choose what we eat today. <laughs> Alrighty. Sister! Hello. <laughs> Hi, lovebirds. Where did you go? You were absent for like a week. Yeah, about that. I have a photo shoot in Paris and Japan for their magazine cover. I'm so proud of you, sis. <laughs> By the way, bring your mom with you this coming Saturday and we'll have a family dinner. Yeah, sure, I'll bring her with me. Oh, wait, someone's calling me. We also need to get going. Theo and I need to look out for the children in the adoption center. Ha, ha, ha.